you sort of notice that I mean, and really the first thing you notice is that like something that you thought was solved or that had like gone away, you notice it sort of like coming back almost for no reason. Um, or like, it's almost like one is triggering oneself. Um, so like the external circumstances aren't causing the thing, but like the emotions are coming back or the feelings are coming back or the memories are coming back. Um, and it can feel like, like pretty acontextual. Um, and I guess like an important thing is that um, the intensity like isn't necessarily any less like it's a very digital thing it's like very sometimes it's like sort of very on or off um and you know like you do a sort of check like is it is it entrenchment or is it burn off and this is sort of where things like the meta protocol come in because sometimes reliving things can kind of like work it in deeper and sometimes reliving things is like loosening those things um or, or one is experiencing those things like for the last time, um, kind of this like redo to undo idea. And, and it's often like a mixture as well. Um, so one has to sort of make the calculation, is it like fractionally net good or fractionally like net like entrenchment or something. Um, but like that just kind of happens over and over again until one day, like it never happens ever again, sometimes with like and sometimes there'll be like big gaps, like you don't experience any of it for like six months. And then um, and then six months later, there's like a little bit more. So like, it doesn't mean that there was like regression. It doesn't mean that one failed. It just means that one hadn't made their way to all of it. Um, and, and typically not always, but like, but often the last time they experience something, it's like just as bad as the first time. Um, but then, but then like, you know, click, like that's all of it. And then they like never experience that thing ever again. And like, sometimes one can tell, sometimes like something turns over or like flattens or like, or like you can sort of feel something kind of clicking into place where like, you know, like that was it, you're done, um, but not always. Um, and so, and so sometimes one has to experience something, experience something like 10 times and each time is like just as bad as the first time. So like, if one doesn't have a model of something like this, then one can think that you can become very discouraged and think that like it's not getting better. Um, but if one, you know, because of prior successes or like kind of is willing to like provisionally trust the theory or something, um, they just know it's like, all right, cool. Well, like, you know, this is like one less time that, that I will like ever experience this ever again. And then eventually it is like the last time and then it's like, and then it's done. Um, so like, you know, so there are, fail, are, are failure modes, like one can, there's ways in which one can experience something for the last time because, because like they successfully like smushed it hard enough that it's like never gonna come up again, all things being equal. But then if they smushed it instead of like kind of metabolizing it or integrating it or evaporating it, then, then yeah, like it's never gonna come up again, sort of, but it's gonna lead to like behavioral rigidity and perversity and like, sort of less slack in the system to make other changes. Um, so there's sort of a right way to do it and a wrong way to do it. Um, and like, you know, so one has to be really careful, like not experiencing something doesn't necessarily mean that they like did the right thing with that thing. Um, so this is where things like the meta protocol come in. Just by having the distinction, the mind is more likely to be like, to be asking that question, whether explicit or implicit, kind of trying to figure out like, because I mean, often people have like the experience of like, you know, ah, like I'm experiencing it less, I'm becoming more numb, or or like I'm becoming more relaxed or more quiet, and then and they think that's good because like, you know, they have no reason to believe that that's like a bad thing to do, because of like priors or like prior experience or what people have told them, um, but but just knowing that, just even just having someone claim like me or somebody or anybody that that's like not necessarily always a good thing with like a little bit of a mechanism um that can be just enough for the system to be like all right you know to be like appropriately suspicious or like appropriately careful or like it'll you know cause the system to watch or pay attention if you will in like a different way and that by itself can like lead to like a better thing happening over time